Hello horror fans, and welcome back to Dead by Daylight. In this episode, I'm going to try to do one of the Killer Master challenges off of the archive by damaging a generator or destroying a dropped pallet five times using the perk Brutal Strength. So with that in mind, I'm going to go ahead and use my character Freddy here. And as far as perks, I'm going to go ahead and use Brutal Strength, which I have to. I'm going to use Barbecue and Chili, which will give me an idea of where other survivors are when I hook one of them as well as giving me additional blood points. I'm going to use Hex Ruin, which should hopefully slow the generator progression some, and I'm going to use a Nurse's Calling to hopefully find out where survivors are healing as long as they're somewhere nearby. Additionally, I'm going to use a Garden Rake, so that way I have the ability to make fake pallets, and I'm going to use a Pustule Petal, so that way I get some extra blood points out of the event. So, let's go ahead and jump into a game. Okay, so we got the Disturbed Ward. It's a bigger map, but Freddy can handle it fairly well, I think. So, let's see how we do here. We did spawn fairly close to our ruin, which spawned right next to a generator. Not what I wanted, really. Alright, well, we're just going to have to make it work as best as we can. No one is back there right now. Alright, somebody is here. And we found him. And we can go ahead and kick this generator. Which should give us the archive achievement that we had needed. So at the same time, I'm going to go ahead and continue chasing her down. Ah. Alright. Perfect. Now let's see if we have one of those hooks nearby, so that way I can start getting those extra blood points for it. Yes, we have one right over here. That'll work out great. Go ahead and put her up on this hook. Damage this generator. Not seeing anyone around here exactly. So let's go ahead and go over here. No one is in the middle here. Alright, so that's good to know. Put up a few more dream pellets here. I sort of want to go check on my ruin again. And I wasn't fast enough. Alright. Well, unfortunately that happened. And it's to be expected, but it did slow the game down for a little here, so that was a good thing. We got another one of our hooks that we need here. We've already, I believe, accomplished the Archive Challenge. So that's a good thing. And it looks like we have somebody running right over here. Perfect. Oh, he ran around the back. Actually, no, he didn't. Where did he go? Interesting. Is he in here? Interesting. I just completely lost him. Huh. Well, all right, then. He has gotten away from me. And I saw the person sneaking around over here. Ah, found him again. All right. That works out fine for me. I'll go ahead and damage some pallets as well. Have no issue with that. 
Alright, we do not have one of our hooks nearby, so we'll just use the good old-fashioned hook here. That was completed over there. And it looks like we probably have somebody that's going to come around this back area. Or up on top. There they are. Alright. Let's go ahead and get rid of that pallet as well. We'll replace it with a pallet. All right. That's fine by me. Alright, this one's just throwing the pallets down quickly. Seems like she knows what my game is with the pallets. Alright. Well, they're getting these generators done fairly quickly. But we did get a knockdown there. Let's go ahead and pick her up. Hang her on this hook. Destroy that pallet. And let's go ahead over here. All right, act like I was channeling over to it. Get somebody running here, which is what I wanted. I heard. You're gonna just go into this locker. I'm gonna take you out. Did you really think I did not see you there? And there's the first dream pallet working in my favor. Alright. Hey, we have our other hook here it looks like, so we'll be able to get those extra blood points. We had this person rescued over here, we can see where they've run off to. So we can go ahead after them. All right.
Alright, we got Jeff here. Let's see what he's gonna do. Dang. Alright, I've gotta watch my generators a bit here, so... Dang. Well, he got the generator, but I think we got the kill out of it, so I'll have to take that. I'm not going to bother going up there with him. Not right there, at least. See if I can catch him going this way. Darn. got her down. Don't know if she's dead or not. I never have gotten that Jeff hung up, which sort of stinks. So I won't have gotten my full blood points because I never did hang that Jeff up. We'll go ahead and force out the Claudette here. And the other Jeff will probably have gotten this door by now. And we'll just have to let him go. No, he has not gotten that door. Is he actually going to look for the hatch or is he just making his way slowly over here. Do not know. Interesting. And he's gotten the door open now. Alright, so two of them got away, two of them were killed, but I think I've achieved the Archive Achievement, so that works out well. Okay, so we can claim the Brutal Breaker Achievement, and let's see what the new collection is. Evan's father thrusts him to the ground, calls him weak tells him he's got to stop being so nice to the maggots. Stop talking to them. Stop helping them. Keep them in line. Break them. Let them know who's boss. If you give them an inch, they'll take a yard. They're just using you. Evan knows better than to say anything. His father punched and broke his jaw last year when he showed weakness. This year, he'd rather not sip dinner through a straw. This year, he holds back, bites his tongue. He wants to tell his father about the union, but doesn't. He feels ashamed. Torn between his loyalty for his father and his friends, Bob, Tom, Jim, they deserve more. I'm going to try to do the archive challenge of earning 50,000 blood points. And for that, I'm going to go ahead and use barbecue and chili, which will help me get more blood points. And show me where survivors are at a distance. I'm going to use Hex Ruin to hopefully slow the generator progression. I'm going to use Thanatophobia, which slows progression when survivors are injured and I'm gonna hope to have them injured a decent amount 
And then I'm going to use a nurse's calling, which will hopefully continue to make them injured more often, which will then allow me to keep Thanatophobia up and slow the game down overall. Okay, so we're in Torment Creek. Not exactly the greatest map, but not too bad overall, I think. So, let's see how this goes. How is my ruin? Well, at least it's behind a wall, it looks like, this time, so that's a good thing. Have not found a survivor yet, so that's not the greatest, but... Well, somebody's been over here. Alright. And we have a Claudette. Not sure what she was thinking there. But I will take it. Alright. We have Claudette down. And we can put her in the basement. So that is definitely a good thing. Alright. Let's go ahead and put down a couple of dream pallets. And we'll go ahead and kick this generator as well as this pallet over here. And I'm going to go ahead and go to check on my ruin. Never mind, I'm actually going to come over here because I know that somebody is down here. That was not what I had hoped for there, but... don't know if that's the same one I had just hooked or not. It was probably, and so they disconnected. Feel a bit bad about that. <laughs> was not my intention at all, but it does happen at points in time. I think it was two Claudettes. To be honest, I was not paying enough attention. Alright. Well, we found this Claudette who thought she was being sneaky, evidently. And it turns out she was being sneaky to a point, because I lost her. But you make a lot of noise, Claudette, when you're injured, so I was able to find you again. Alright. Where is... Oh, my specialty hook is way over there. Not going to be able to get that anytime soon. Alright. So let's go ahead and leave this area do want her to get rescued at a point. As I said, I feel bad enough about uh, that one feeling tunneled. Alright, we have a generator over here being worked on. check to see if anybody was in there. Alright. Does look like they are not in the area right now. So. 
We'll go ahead and wander away from that generator. That one's still sparking. All right, and we have another generator that's very progressed over here. No idea where these people have gone to. They definitely seem to... There we go! Alright. Just got him with the tip of the blades. Now I want to try to take him out this way. Hopefully he didn't see my ruin there. That's my goal. And we're going to go ahead and teleport way over here. And again, this person has disappeared on me. Not what I had hoped for. Alright, we can see these two healing over here. I'm actually going to go after the Meg and be nice to the Jake in that case. That's the wrong way up there. I'm going to turn this way so that hopefully I don't get blinded. Not going to be able to get over to that good hook still. This is still sparking over here. Good. Alright, well, Jake decided to stay around here. And actually, I see the Claudette there as well. Not gonna be able to make it over to that. Gonna go ahead and put him up here. And you instant rescued right in front of me. Okay, well. Hopefully you guys ran off. I mean, in this case, I'm actually cheering for you to have run off, because I really don't want the game to end that quickly. I would like to get a few more points. want to go after the Claudette if I can. I think this is a Claudette here. Ah, yes it is. Good. All right. Can I make it over to this hook? I'm going to try. I'm in a good position overall in this match. People are wounded, so Thanatophobia is working well for me. If I can get her onto this hook, I'll be in good shape. Perfect. And that was... The one who disconnected was not the Claudette I had hit before. So, I will not get my four stacks because the Claudette decided to disconnect. That's rather unfortunate.
And I at least can know that, yeah, I did not tunnel the person down or anything. They just got knocked down and decided to disconnect because of it. All right. So we know where they are. Or at least where they were. Keep checking the locker. Still haven't found anyone in it, but that's all right. Oh, found you, though. Ooh, nice job. All right. Really, I don't want to kill you. Not yet, but... I guess I don't get much of a choice in the matter here. Really, my best hope is to kill him and then see where she might be. So, let's go ahead and take him to a far back hook here. Hopefully she's on the other side of the map and we'll see her using barbecue and chili. All right. So we did find her, and we got her knocked down. <laughs> Gonna go ahead and hang her up here. All right. So, not sure why the one person DC'd. Hopefully I did, did get enough blood points to do my archive mission of 50,000 blood points, but we'll have to see. We got Ruthless Killer, which is good. And we did complete the archive challenge, so that works out well. Okay, if you've enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like. And if you have not already, please go ahead and click the bell icon as well as subscribe to the channel so that way you're aware when I produce new videos in the future. Thank you, and I hope to see you all in the fog.